Oh, are you intrigued by golf's greatest recent wonder too? Curious if Phil Mickelson, after becoming the oldest major champion in golf history last month, can return to his birthplace of San Diego on the week of his 51st birthday and win the one major that's eluded him? It is a wild confluence of circumstances, no doubt, but this US Open drama for Mickelson goes even deeper. To be honest with you, one of the worst collapses in US <laughs> Open history by Phil Mickelson. Let's start with the major itself. Mickelson, who has won each of the other three majors, has been the runner-up at the US Open six times, the most ever, but he has never hoisted the trophy. And recently, it's been much worse. He hasn't been in contention at the US Open since 2013, and last year, he missed the cut. So this might not be Phil's last chance, but his best remaining chance. Are the nerves getting to him? Well, you decide. There's something about the Wanamaker that just gives it that little extra. <laughs> but don't fool yourself. Mickelson isn't relaxing. Those close to him say he's dialed in, tightening up his game with a focus that has caught the attention of those wondering if he'll have what it takes this weekend. Now for the real catch. This year's US Open host is Mickelson's hometown, where he played high school matches, where he won his second PGA Tour event, where he won again in 2000 and 2001, until a course redesign that year changed everything. Not even close. Yep. And just gone bogey bogey for no reason. No longer playing to his game's strengths, Mickelson hasn't finished in the top 10 at a Torrey Pines event in 10 years. Once his true love, where he opened the eyes of the golf world, Torrey Pines is now his greatest nemesis, and he stands against it for what could be one final act. So do you see it now? Why Mickelson's week ahead goes well beyond mustering renewed magic at 51 years old? Why this fairy tale? would be so wildly cool. The odds are stacked against him in every possible way except one. The magic of Mickelson is alive again.